Hey guys, this is Damon from Pop Hunters and Hey guys, this is Damon from Pop Hunters Anonymous here, and today I'm going to be giving you guys a look at the Squirrel Girl Funko Pop. Now, this is a part of the Marvel line, Pop Marvel line. It is number 144 in the line, and it is exclusive to the Marvel Collector Core Box, which was just this past month with the Woman of Power Box. Now, on the side of the box, it's your standard concept art. What's really cool is you do get a little look at the little squirrel that comes in here with the pop as well. And on the back, which I did note in the unboxing video for the Collector Core, is that it does contain all of the female characters from the new Marvel line. That, of course, includes Spider-Gwen, She-Hulk, Captain Marvel, and then the variants Spider-Gwen Unmasked, Spider-Gwen Unhooded, and Captain Marvel Masked. Alright, so let's see what this pop looks like underneath. I can already tell I'm going to absolutely love it. Alright, so first let's look at the actual Squirrel Girl Pop, which is, seriously, let's see if I can get a good focus on there, awesome, for lack of any other better word. Um, after watching the teaser for the Marvel Collector Core box, of course, we did kind of expect Squirrel Girl to be the pop, um, just from the little clip and the teases, the teases they kept revealing throughout the promotion of the box. Um, though I'm pretty sure a lot of people didn't expect them to go this route. It is a very niche character. Um, it does have a really big following. She does. She has a really big following. Um, it's very similar to the Morbius pop that was in the villains box, which is also a very niche character that managed to get his own pop as well. But um, I just I gotta say, man, I really really dig this pop. Uh, the bobblehead is really the bobble's really nice for a bobblehead. I'm not a big fan of the bobbleheads, but lately they've been on par. Um, let's get a close up here, and you can see like the tail. It's just, it's the, the details on the tail is awesome. You can see like little ruffles in the fur. I don't know why there's this little, you know, separation here. Can't really tell what that's for, but if it turns or anything like that, but I'm not going to try it. Um, the suit is awesome. The, the paint on the boots is phenomenal. Um, you can really see the nice little, you know, ruffles on the jacket here. Let's get a nice focus. Alright, so, like, the belt separation here looks awesome. You can tell, like, this is all very, almost fur-based, including this little part in the jacket there. But I really dig, you have acorn earrings, which is a nice little touch. It's not the first pop we've seen with earrings. Uh, Luna Lovegood contains little strawberry earrings, which is cool. You have the ears on the top with the headband there as well. Really nice little touch. And the hair is such a nice mold. It's just, everything about this pop is so, there's so much detail put into it and so much definitely you can tell like they have a, a care for this character as well like a lot of the you know big fans of the comic books do as well they put a lot of care into this pop it's it's absolutely incredible i can't believe they went that route and they did a squirrel girl pop i'm very very excited to see that and the best thing about this is it's not the only thing you get in there you do also get let's see if i can get this thing out all right, so I am an inbox collector, and it looks like this thing is going to be a pain to get out. So I'm just going to show you guys right here. It comes with a little squirrel, and the squirrel has like a little bow tie in the back, which is really cute. And the squirrel looks to be also a bobblehead, very similar to uh, the Ant-Man that came with the mini Ant-Man pop bobblehead. Eh, that's not going to stand very well. But overall, man, I'm really satisfied with this pop. After taking it out of the box, I can honestly say that maybe I would have paid full price, the price of the box for just this pop alone, um, which essentially I did because I'm not a fan of everything else that's in the box. If you saw the unboxing, you would know. But I just, I'm, I'm really digging it, man. I really, really like this pop. So that's all on that. Be sure to like, comment, and subscribe. And as always, thanks for watching.